goodbye. Okay, we can take my Lambo. I'll put on a tight show. You sure you can handle? We be faster than Django. Okay. Oh shit! I'm still eating dinner. <laughs> <laughs> and you're in the bottom corner. This is this is weird. Hold on, wait a minute. Let me move. The, the music ended too quickly. Yeah. I, I like to stand down in the bottom. I was I shoving food should... in my face as fast as I could. I was like, "Ah, oh, crap! It's hurry up, hurry up, hurry up." I'm sorry. Dan, just stay down in the bottom corner. I like that. <laughs> I would move you further in the corner, but you can, you know that's as far okay. as it goes. <laughs> <laughs> Jokes on you. I like being in the corner. Okay, I guess. <laughs> um, hello, everyone. I'm gonna apologize now because I'm still eating dinner because it showed up late and they screwed up my order. But whatever. Dave, yeah. you're in another racing school. Yeah, and it's pouring oh. at Pocono. It was pouring. Oh. Fucking crazy. Hmm. Really. Well, it's a good, uh, good racing school day then, I guess. You learn a lot. Learn a lot. How far <laughs> away is Pocono from you, Steve? It's a, it's a while. It's like probably two hours north of me, but it, it, the whole front just came through all of Pennsylvania. <laughs> Ben's oh. doing the same thing. I am having Mediterranean food. Mm-hmm. The um, the place we ordered from is usually like tip top and i don't know what happened tonight and they must have mixed up our order with someone else's because we got the food and we're like i don't know i don't know what this is <laughs> is it good at least yeah good? i mean it tastes good but i was like yo i'm not paying for something i didn't order so you know it's fair unless yeah. you got the more expensive order what if that, that order oh it definitely was more- not no it definitely oh, was order. not more expensive no like it was like nowhere near because usually the the stuff we get has enough for like leftovers for like two or three extra meals because it's amazing, but it's some sort of weird chicken. Hmm. Uh, I don't. Know. I mean, it tastes hmm. good, but you know. Tim's here. Hey, hey Tim. Hey Tim. How See, you doing? Brent gets it. Hey Tim. <laughs> hey, Tim. <laughs> no, those seat controls are in a horrible position. <laughs> Brent gets it. Yeah. I agree. I'm not going I'm not disagree with Adam. I think they're stupid to put them there. But what like why? Oh yeah, it is Dan- Daniel yeah. is in here too. Look yeah. I, I, I do love the people that were saying that you didn't know what kind of car you were driving in the comments and it was like, dude, it's literally Daniel's car. <laughs> like <laughs> Well, and people were all like, "Oh, you you got the one, with, you got the transmission wrong." I'm like, "Sorry, like I, I'm not an yeah. ass an expert." And I googled it, and according to everything I read in Google, 
That was correct, but I guess yeah. the wiki page is wrong. What did you say it was? So, I said it was the ZF eight speed, and it's not. It's the six speed. Yeah, you could have just shifted through the gears to find out what how many gears it had. Uh, get, I mean, <laughs> I yeah, mean that's a it, pretty easy one. <laughs> it's yeah, sure. Except for like, I did that. I talked about before I drove it. Oh, okay. How I think, am I supposed to like you know? I guess, just, I, they, I don't really. They went with the eight speed like the following year. Yeah. The stupid wiki said it was that year. Well, Whatever. that just goes to show you can't believe everything you read on the internet. That's right. Right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well. Yeah. I don't think any of us are cool enough or would want to be at the Tesla party right now. So. Oh, dude. Is they have like. Yeah, yeah. They had yesterday right when I was now? driving. Yeah, when I was driving home from EAG yesterday, they had they were setting up all kinds of stages and like light things up, and they had like a big metal ball. I mean, I'm, it must have been like fifty feet tall. It was like this giant, like you know, when back when we were kids, when kids were in a bunch of little pansies, those metal things that you could climb over and everything like that. That's what it looks like, except nice. like fifty foot tall. It looked awesome. There was apparently a giant boot, too. I, I don't know. I saw a picture. It wasn't there when I drove by. Okay. It might have been boot? after the fact, but yeah, like they're a, like, hey, let's be Texas, have a boot. Yeah, <laughs> like so Texas, yay! I need a gun for that. Yeah. Right. <laughs> um, how many hours did it take to film? What the review? The Aston. The Aston, probably three. I'm gonna guess. Usually, car reviews take about two or three hours to film. Oh, um. it's 100 <sighs> degrees in Newport Coast, California. Really? Really? Screw that. Oh, uh, <laughs> Josh is the best thing I watched this evening. More of this, please. <laughs> I love it because it is a 100. percent You either love it or hate it. There's yep. no in between. <laughs> Is he getting a bunch of hate email or I mean there's some there's some negative comments, but it's mostly positive. Yeah. But it's funny because like most of the negative comments, you read it and you're like, you're exactly the person that he's talking about. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't gone through many of the comments. Oh. It's it's <laughs> Joshua Savage, yeah. Oh yeah. It was hilarious. Mm-hmm. Oh, when is the move? May 15th. We don't move for a while. So, yeah, we got we got some time. Sorry, I'm still eating. How dare you? I know. I, I feel like an asshole, but I don't care. You I'm should. Hungry. You are an asshole. Although, there's no dislikes on that video. I just won't quote. That's because you can't see dislikes. We can yeah. only see it on the back end. They removed oh, really? the dislikes. Yeah, they removed showing the dislikes. Um, are we really going to put a manual at 4.30? I mean, Maybe. Maybe. It totally depends. I mean, I love the insane amount of quacking in Josh's video. <laughs> Let me just say, that video took forever to edit because of that. Like, having to go through every single time he quacks and, and then oh, I bet. Yeah. isolate that sound, add the quack, mute his stuff. Yeah. Did you get a count? I think no, somebody. I, I, well, I don't know. That would have taken even longer. One of the pe one of the commenters, I think, said like seventy nine or something like that. So it's one hundred twenty four, but I don't know what's accurate. Oh, that's uh -oh. amazing. Maybe it was. Uh, yeah, I don't know. It wouldn't surprise me if he hit triple digits. It was a lot. I don't think it was triple digits. Excuse me. I don't think. No, there's no way. Um, <laughs> that's funny. Hmm. I like this comment. I have watched you grow and grind. Happy for you guys. True motivation. Well, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. It's been, a, it's been a long journey, let me tell you. John yeah. counted 121. Maybe I was off. Maybe I was looking at something different. Yeah, John counted like 121. Yeah. Dang. Jeez. I mean, if that's accurate, that's impressive, actually, for like a, for a, like, what is it, like 18 minutes? minute video? <laughs> <laughs> it's, what does that break down to F's per minute? Man, mm. somebody do the math. I'm terrible at math. Let me know how many is that per minute. If it based off of 121, 
in 18 minutes. What does that work out to in quacks per minute? Was it was it 18 minutes? Mm -hmm. It was like yeah, it was like 18 and some change. Like 15 quacks a minute. <laughs> <laughs> It's awesome. <laughs> and so that works out to be like one every four seconds on average. No, no, no. People are saying 6.7. Yeah. Yeah, okay. I went too far. Sorry. Oh, okay. See, this is why I don't do math. Yeah. <laughs> and I have a fucking calculator. <laughs> 6.7 per minute. Wow. Can I just say, my favorite part is when he talks about Sunday. And he's like, guess who else doesn't work on Sunday? Happened <laughs> <laughs> me. <laughs> oh my god, I cracked up so hard when he said that. Oh man, it's so true. Like it is. Who's driving their Ferrari on a Wednesday? You know, like. <laughs> well, then know. maybe Josh should just adjust his work hours and take like Wednesday, Thursday off so that he can work, you know, yeah. Friday through Tuesday. There you go. But then someone's a bitch that he's not there. Why aren't you there on a Wednesday? Well, yeah. like we said, you know, you there's always going to be somebody who's unhappy no matter what it is that you do. So. No, he's in a he's in a spot where it doesn't matter what he does, someone's going to complain just like we are. Yeah, less than 10 seconds apart. That's still impressive. That's actually quite impressive. Those yeah, are rookie I mean, numbers. You need to pump those numbers up. <laughs> right? <laughs> We're not meeting quotas we're not here. We're not checking, right? <laughs> oh, dude, seriously, yeah. If you were playing a drinking yeah. game for the quack, <laughs> you'd, you'd you, be dead. You'd be you dead. Just, you would just have to keep drinking the whole time. Yeah. Like you couldn't <laughs> actually take it away from your mouth. You would just be. You'd have to have like an eighteen-minute-long bottle that you can drink from. <laughs> eighteen-minute-long <laughs> bottle. You'd be so screwed. You'd be dead. Do, you can't play that game. Don't don't play the Josh drinking game. All right, it doesn't. It ends poorly. Trust me. Math proves it. Uh, there's another good a good vet video coming out on Saturday too, though. Edit good from our or funny from our point of view. I guess you guys. Yeah, to tell Saturday's us. video. I don't think it's gonna get good views, but it's funny. The people who watch it will like it, though. I think. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> let's see i'm looking uh how many down votes uh hold on i don't know where to 67 find it. 67 all right i can go two fix more, that yeah two more people need to go dislike that video just two of you <laughs> that's funny it's got a it's got a pretty low like to dislike ratio like nice. we usually are in the upper upper 90s like usually 98 or higher and he's at 88.7 <laughs> definitely pissed it, off it was the customers that he was talking about they're like he's talking about me i know so people got butt hurt. Like, like oh how dare he speak the truth i'm trying to find the last video that got is poor a like ratio they're the people who think that the customer is always right I'll tell you right now, the customer is not always right. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I don't care what y'all say. I mean, here's the funny thing. Like, now that we're we're selling parts to people, we get some customers that are high touch. I'll just say it politely. And it's high hard. It's hard because, like, we don't, we don't make much per customer, generally speaking, unless you, like, buy a massive exhaust or something like that. But when you're, you're buying your package... Yeah, like if you buy a full-on exhaust, okay, we might make a little bit of money. But like most people, we're making like 5 to $20. That's it. And so if you're calling us and getting on our crap like over and over, it's like, dude, we ain't making anything now. <laughs> <laughs> like we are losing so much money. Uh, I'm having to go back really, really far. Hmm. You're still looking for that. <laughs> uh -huh. oh, 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 there it is. Okay. The last video that got as poor a like to dislike ratio was Meg's review of my pickup truck. 
February twenty fifth of twenty twenty one. Bunch of triggered truck guys. Yeah, I was gonna say. Holy Wait, God. what movie was it? I was reading something. Meg's truck review. The review of my truck. Oh yeah, they are. Wow. Well, it was probably all the people with lifted trucks who have small oh, yeah. egos, if you know what I mean, <laughs> that yeah. had to dislike it. Oh, are we still partnered with Fabspeed? I and mean, we sell Fabspeed products. Um, we had a stop. Unfortunately, we can't offer the NGS 10 on Fabspeed stuff because their margins, margins are completely inconsistent. It's <laughs> so like one product will be like a 20% margin and one product will be a 5% margin. And so that bit us in the ass more than once. And so we just said, nope, we can't do it. So if you it, basically, if you want Fabspeed stuff and you want a good deal on it, you got to email us. We'll hook you up, but we just we can't do it like holes, you know, like across the board. So it just because the amount of effort it would take to program that into the system would take us like weeks. So we're just like, no, sorry, it's unfortunate. But yeah, we still sell their stuff. That's fine. You're not the only one that we had to cut the. Uh discount off on either yeah there's a couple other companies like and it's it's annoying because like companies won't tell us when they change prices and stuff and all of a sudden someone will order some part and then we're like we submit it to the company we're like oh that's cool we just lost money we just <laughs> lost six hundred dollars <laughs> yeah we're like oh that's Man. great we just subsidized someone else's part purchase so we're if like if it's like two or three dollars we just yeah we just, go. It's we just need it, it. This, but sometimes... this has happened this has happened probably like twenty times now. Where we sometimes just we it. have to, yeah. Sometimes we have to email the people, and it's really awkward. And for somebody who thrives on awkwardness as much as I do, <laughs> even that is a little too awkward for me, and I hate doing it. But I mean, when we're losing lots of money. I mean, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, no, I'm good. Thank you. Any thoughts on offering extended warranty and cars to sell partnering with third party company no. or selling them? <laughs> uh, I don't think that any third party company would put a warranty on a supercar. So. It's really hard to get a warranty on a supercar. And the problem is like, it's so unpredictable. Like, you know, we saw a car, it's in perfect condition. Someone takes it home and it just happens to be the moment that the trans goes out. Yep. Yeah. You know, it's, it's like, bad luck. <laughs> so it just, and here's the other problem is like if we offer a warranty, every little rink a ding thing that goes wrong, they're gonna come back to us on it. Yep. Yeah. So oh, just, the the leather doesn't smell right on the dashboard. I need you to uh, warranty that for me. Oh god, here we go. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Helicopter in. <Yay>. Hola. <laughs> <laughs> I got to deliver, man. Come on. Right? <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Yeah, Stu, why didn't you go to the opening if you had a ticket? Curious what he says. The factory is one mile long? Really? Yeah. It looks about it. I, I got 0.9 on the odometer driving past, so let's bay I can uh, see a mile. I know. Do you and lie. Stu, people are paying people are like buying invites like you could have made a couple hundred dollars off of that thing Jeez. Why? That's for it to go yeah. why would you go i don't know uh, that, it, i'm sure it's a mega party over there it seems like a mega annoyance to me <laughs> well thankfully there's no real housing around there so one of my uh, buddies uh, from uh, fair enough, Stu. Is actually here for this party he uh, he and a couple of his partners um, have a electric car charging network in India. Hmm. So Tesla is going to partner with them and start selling cars in India. So uh, he got flown out with his partners to, for this party, and then tomorrow they're going to SpaceX in Boca Chica to go check out that facility. Fucking badass time, you know. I, I wish yeah. I could do that shit. I know. I, I want to go check out yeah. Boca Chica. That's yeah. for sure. And then on Sunday they're they're going to MotoGP and then flying back. Nice. Oh, yeah, that's this weekend, huh? Oh, yep. There's going to be fireworks at the thing. We might be close enough we could hear the fireworks. My dog is going to freak out. <laughs> no, that's pretty far. You can definitely see the lighted drone show, though. Yep. Hopefully that will end up on YouTube or something. Yeah. It'll probably be a QR code of, like, a Rick Roll. All right. <laughs> that's something, that is something that's you want. Something to do. Do. They just did that. 
they did that in Austin like a couple weeks ago. <laughs> oh, at oh, South by? Yeah, it's South by. I thought that was brilliant. <laughs> I mean, if I'm going to pay a bunch of money to have some stupid drones flying in the air, that's exactly what I'm going to use my money for. <laughs> Just saying. I'm surprised yeah. that the cameras were able to recognize a QR code from flying drones. That's pretty impressive, actually. Yeah. Hmm. Right. Yeah. I guess we should probably talk about some of this car stuff, huh? So, like, it's what? Kind of, is this a car channel? Yeah, it's not really. <laughs> What's Dan drinking? Oh, Mousetrap. Dan hey. Mousetrap. Thank you. Mousetrap. Oh. Thank you. That was, yes, Ben, <laughs> in honor of Ben. See? See? Yep. I have to deliver. Yeah, that's track, right. Are you able to pick oh, which one you want, which background you want, or did that just happen by chance? Hmm. I'm curious. I don't remember what wine this is. It's some Italian wine. I always drink Italian wine. Um, so it's been an adventurous week. Um, so first of all, the CNC machine at EAG is actually turning out parts. Woo! Like, like legitimately making parts and those first parts are going in my five by nine. So that's it's pretty happening. exciting. Yeah. Awesome. <laughs> so um, I don't think it's gonna be done this week just cause it's taking. Oh, more. come on guys. Why would you ask a question like that? You know, it's not gonna be done this week. <laughs> don't ask that. I'm, just, I'm hedging that question. So you don't have to. Oh, okay. <laughs> I think. Wait, Wait, do your 360 was in the shop? Who here is shocked to hear that? Wait, it was in the shop again. <laughs> for, what? Well, for let me guess, the the top. It's gotta be the top. Right? <laughs> How? <laughs> yeah, I'm just at a loss. ETA the five and nine. I mean. It'll be done when it's done. I, that's the thing. We can't predict it anymore. Like, I'm not even going to try. There's there's no point because you just don't know. Like, there's there's a bunch of stuff that's in the ethers that you just you can't predict. But, um... <laughs> just buy a coop and then you don't have to worry about that. Yeah. <laughs> Just lock it up, and you don't have to worry about that. Um, oh, am I gonna sell the five nine pretty quick when it's done? I mean, as Thank soon as you, it's sure. done, as soon as it's done, I'll start taking offers. And I, but I don't want to sell it too quick because I want to kind of show it off a bit. Like I feel like it's a pretty big milestone for EAG because it's it's a we have to market it. Yeah, mm -hmm. we need to market a yeah, bit. Like, I, marketing, yeah. I wanna I wanna offer it to any major YouTubers to come drive it. Nice. Doug DeMiro, so, man. Yeah, exactly. Like, if those guys want to drive it, great. Um, Let me see how many subscribers I have. <laughs> on, on <laughs> yeah. Right? Three. Obviously, that's, that's going to be the balance, right? I have to balance how many people drive it with how many miles we put on it because I still need to make money on that car. And I don't want to, like, just put a ton of miles on it and have it be worth nothing. Mm -hmm. But... Um, yeah. You supercar people in your miles. Hey, you better let cars. me drive it. No. Okay. Oh. Drive that. Come on. <laughs> Someday, Adam, when it's your money, you're gonna go. I don't. I'm gonna hold back on the miles because I want to make money on it. So I just so on the car. <laughs> I, I mean, uh, I, it is of my opinion. If you can't afford the depreciation, you can't. You're afford in. The car. You're in the business of selling cars now. <laughs> yeah. So, okay, well, I'll tell you what. You go sell your Porsche, take your money, and go buy a car, and I'll go drive a fuck ton of miles on it and see how you feel. Come drive the Porsche. <laughs> cool. It already has a fuck ton of miles. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> <laughs> it's about to hit 134000 You go buy, you go buy. I told so you I'm already planning like... on doing it. Huh? I'm already planning on doing it. Doing what? Buying a car, a six-figure car, and daily driving it and putting a boatload of miles. I know, but you're not, but you're not buying the cars to make money in the cars. Yeah. Okay. That's so different. okay, in the five nine nine, yes, I guess it's different because it would be. You're not okay. All right. You're I mean, right. Has put you're, right. right. you're right. You're right. The wrong. objective, the yes. objective of yeah. the cars okay. we're buying right now aren't to have fun with the cars yeah. to make money. He didn't there, put a bunch of miles right. on his 458 and his 430. So Dan's yeah. excluded from this. 
right, right. I'm the I'm the one who you should be uh, blaming that anger at Adam, pointing that anger at. Him. I'm the one who doesn't put miles on my car. Yeah, we've put more miles on your BMW or the BMW you used to have in like four months than you did the entire year you owned it. Yeah, I, I put the entire eight months I owned it. I put I think eight hundred miles on it. It rolled over sixty thousand miles on Sunday. Jeez. <laughs> Wait, what did you buy it with? You bought it like forty something, 50, right? Fifty two. Wow. Oh, I bought it. I think fifty one two hundred, and I sold okay. Adam at like fifty two. <laughs> we That's are an old married couple, Cheryl. We are. <laughs> <laughs> I tell you what. There's a fact. There's a uh, the the harder I'm on, harder I am on someone, the more I like them. <laughs> if if I'm really nice to you, I probably hate you. <laughs> <laughs> It's true. When I really get on his nerves, he quits talking to me. Because <laughs> I don't want to be mean. <laughs> we, had, we had a business discussion, let's say, the other day. <laughs> and he said, you know, business. <laughs> and, and uh, the text messages stopped coming in. They stopped flowing for a couple of hours. <laughs> That was, to, to be fair, sometimes I it legit legit is because I get busy and I can't answer right away. It wasn't this time though, probably not. That is a, <laughs> that is a good habit though, when, when, especially on text. If you oh yeah, fight, you gotta walk away. One way, walk away, breathe, come back. Yeah, cause, well, cause, especially because text, you can't. Uh, you can't. There's a lot of context. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, and, and yeah, emotion doesn't go through or anything. You're just, you might be saying something nice and then, you know, or not nice, you know, nicely. Right. <laughs> but it comes off right. as, uh, hey, what an asshole. <laughs> yeah. It's, it's hard. It's hard to convey the right message over text or whatever, or emails or, you know, any of that stuff. It's, yep. yeah. Yeah. Whoops, <laughs> yeah, trying his hair plugs this week. He's not like pretty late showing up. He's always late. He always shows up. He got burnt last week. He's not gonna show up. <laughs> oh my God. Last week was brutal. I'd forgotten about that. Oh, I'm not moving this week. I've got over a month and a half. Then so when you put when you put the front of your hair up like that, then it looks like your hair's thinning. Maybe Whoa. it is actually thinning. I don't know shit. Maybe is this the channel of like yeah, hating on dudes with hair issues? <laughs> <laughs> I just know. <laughs> I, I just got my summer haircut. That's why it's so short. John, you really thought I bought a 360? <laughs> <laughs> I, I thought going to. I, We're going to get him to do it. I thought uh, I oversold the, the whole April Fool's joke when I did That was pretty good. It was good. That was great. I thought that was funny. I One of these people, days, I think, though. I think, no, the best part is that your dad fell for it. My dad called yeah. me. So, okay. <laughs> so, I, my dad called me, and I said, and the first thing he says to me is, you sold the Porsche? And I was like, <laughs> <laughs> and I go, dad, what day is it? And he goes, Friday. And I'm like, <laughs> I'm like, no, what day is it? And Yo. I was like, Oh. Oh. I'm, st I'm still alive. Yay! I, I'm assuming I'm assuming that we don't have a sale. I te I texted you guys. I think we do actually. What? Yeah. <laughs> no way. I think we do. Making moves live on the air. Yeah. I don't want to say too much. I don't want to say too much. I'll tell you guys after okay. what happened. Okay. Wow. <laughs> I would. Yeah. And that's, on top of that, it's the shit that I live for, though. Friends. <laughs> when I yeah, I, I, on the post live, we'll have to get the the lowdown. Yeah. Well, yeah, I, I put my gun in my pocket. I went down there. My heart's racing. I got the adrenaline going. I'm like, I'm right. Let's do this. I'm ready. <laughs> oh, some sketchy shit went down. Oh, God. Yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> I didn't hear this. <laughs> yeah, it was. Uh, let's just say we got a we got a uh, D or a. Uh, um, Facebook message, and the, oh, no. the dude was all like, I'm going to buy it tonight, cash. And we were like, mm. you know, like, anytime like anyone's like rushing a supercar sale, you're always like, is this for real? Right. You know, like, okay, and cash, mm, 
yeah. Anyway, so yeah, it was it was fascinating. It's been a fascinating night. It's been a crazy week, actually. <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay. Oh, so okay. I didn't I didn't get to all that stuff. We we got sidetracked with Adam's uh, April Fool's joke. Oh. Um, <laughs> which was brilliant, by the way. I, I I woke up, saw that, and I was like, "Oh yeah, oh yeah." <laughs> um, so we bought two cars this week. <laughs> one of them was kind of an accident. One of them was sort, yeah. One of them was sort of an accident. Um, like <laughs> debatable. The first, the first one was totally legit. Like, so I, I, I mean, I'm not gonna tell you what it is because I I really feel like you guys need to see this car. Can I give him a hint? Can I give him a hint? Sure. It's got scissor doors. Mm. We should tell They're not them. scissor doors. These are the hard... There's They're a lot of scissor doors. Whatever you call them. They're Dogs. articulating. Whatever. No, these no. are the hardcore fans. We should tell these people what it is. is, it, is it, the does ones. it go like this? Or does it go like this? They are, they are the doors of a billionaire. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. So that car was very calculated. So like we we all saw it, we looked at it. Uh, I should say we looked at it online. It was wasn't in person, obviously. The car was not local. Um, and so the three of us kind of like were like, "Hey, here's how much we want to pay for it." Blah blah blah, whatever. And so it was an auction car. Like it was uh, on the uh, uh, wholesale on the, on the block. It went through the on auction. The yeah, on the block. And it was live. So. Mm-hmm. so it was the morning of the auction and so i'm sitting there on my cell phone waiting for the car to come up and trying to take care of my son in the morning and like they keep screwing up the auction they keep jumping around from the wrong like they're going out of order well what happened what happens is the bigger dealerships that run a lot of cars through get priority so if yeah. they have a car that says hey we need this to go through right away then they'll kick oh. them up front and they'll kick the the guys that don't sell as many to the back of the line basically so they don't follow the order they're supposed to so you have to sit there for two hours and wait for your car to yeah. come through and really pay attention because you might miss it right right so the car was number 38 so like if each car takes one minute it should have been 38 minutes after the start of the auction approximately plus or minus a little bit we're in like an hour and a half and they're all over the board. So finally I'm like, all right, screw this. I'm going to go for a walk. Cause like I usually take a walk in the morning with my, with my son and my dog. So I'm on the walk watching, watching the auction live, like as it's scrolling through. And Dan you know? and I are texting back and forth. Yeah, we're texting, like, <laughs> and we're like all three of us are collaborating. We're like, Oh, you know, like when is this damn thing going to finally come? All of a sudden, like, like in, like I got nervous because a couple parts like I lost reception and it stopped and I'm like oh crap and I had to like restart it and I'm like oh okay and all of a sudden like all of a sudden just they jumped to it like they jumped yeah, to it randomly hmm. and I'm like oh crap here it is so I'm like okay uh, watching you know they started way higher than you'd ever pay for it right and they come down come down come down come down come down they got to where we were willing to pay and they came down below that a couple notches so finally I'm like. Okay, I'll bid. And as soon as I bid, it instantly, like five other people start bidding. It goes boom, 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 boom. Jumps up really fast. I'm like, oh crap. <laughs> so then we got it like we were we were the top bidder. And then it started to slow down and someone outbid us. We bid again. It slowed down again. Someone bid. And then like we bid at exactly what we thought we were like, we were tapped out. Like we we hit our mark. And it goes, you know, like no one's bidding, no one's bidding, no one's bidding. Okay, last chance. And all of a sudden, someone bids, and we're like, "Oh, uh, damn it!" But it was only a small increment. It wasn't like a thousand. Well, they, 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 once they get to the end like that, the incre- increments were a thousand, and then took them to five hundred, and we're like, "Yeah, ah, we can do another 500. So I'm like, "All right, I'll do another five hundred. But I waited, I waited until like he's like, "Blah blah 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 blah." Last chance. And I'm like, click. <laughs> And so then it went through and we got it. And we were like, holy crap, we actually got it. So we only paid a thousand over what we thought we wanted, like what we thought it was worth. I think we should tell the hardcore fans what it is. Do you guys really want to know what it is? Of course we do. They are a bunch of them already know. So it's a 12C. I mean, well, they've already they've already got yeah, they've already got the McLaren. Yeah, it's a 12C. (laughs) Should hopefully be here early next week. Yeah. Well, it's uh, it's an antique fireplace. Sorry. 
<laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. It's old school. Uh, so we'll but, see how how bad or good that is. We um, figure we got to try one and, and see if it's as bad as people say or if it's as right. good or whatever. Heck yeah, I want to check <laughs> it out. And, and bigger. We all do. <laughs> The more important question to us is like, can we make money on McLaren? Exa- yeah, exactly. Yeah. So we, I kind of I joked with the guys. I'm like, if if this doesn't make money, we're done with McLaren. <laughs> well, you <laughs> were done with the British cars last week, so you know we're we're chipping away at well, you. McLaren is British. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's what yeah. I mean. Dan yeah, said he was yeah. done with the British cars, and now you bought. I, I mean, I'm done. With, there's no way in hell you could not convince me to buy a Jaguar or an Aston. No way. I don't know, man. A Jag. Yeah, <laughs> it's too bad yeah. because I I loved that Jag. That was a, such a cool car. But the twelve C is badass. It's that. It's that. I forget what they call it. It's like a pearl red, with oh, the carbon yeah. fiber with the carbon fiber package and the leather interior. It's pretty. It's pretty cool. Yeah, looking. it's pretty legit. Yeah. It's got twenty thousand miles on it. Thanks. Nice. Yeah, I'm pumped. To see it. Are there twelve Cs with non leather interiors? Yeah, you can get Alcantara. Alcantara, yeah. yeah. What's the training? Huh? It's a DCT. Yeah. yeah, it's DCT. Yeah, but those yeah. transmissions are the ones you got to watch out for. The yeah. Season. Yeah, well, I figure if it's got 21,000 miles on it, the transmission is probably okay. Maybe. We'll find <laughs> out. <laughs> yeah, we'll, we'll find out. <laughs> <laughs> Don't get a lotus. Don't get a lotus. <laughs> and, and, and yes, the twelve C is technically faster than the four five eight by like the tiniest little bit. Doesn't but half the price. But half the price. It's true. Yeah. It's literally half the price. Yep. Jeez. Well, Alcantara uh, is like suede. John. Tyler. Tyler. It's, it's, syn- it's a synthetic yeah. suede that's made in Italy. Yeah, yeah. It's it's actual brand name. Alcantara is a brand name. Oh, is yeah. it? I didn't know. Yeah. That. I didn't know that. Yeah. Huh. Yeah. And to JS uh, three hundred and sixty, that happened last tour. So I just figured out to find the right one and had the. Oh yeah, we've already ruined order. Tyler. Yeah, he already wants a Ferrari. I might still keep the Jag, but we'll see. <laughs> Lotus. <laughs> <laughs> I would be okay if we did a um, a uh, a Lotus, an older no. one. Uh uh-uh. no. uh no 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 way <laughs> I would do a lotus with you Josh no <laughs> no and I'd do an older Elise just to have fun with it a little bit and maybe take it to the track and then sell it no <laughs> <laughs> I mean at least buy our dinner first <laughs> wait hold on a window <laughs> fell out of your lotus on you, the interstate oh my god. The- that is the most Lotus thing I've ever heard in my life. Right, right. <laughs> you guys don't like a Lotus Esprit, an older one? I think they're cool. They I look cool. Like they're sure, cool. they look cool. Someone else can own them. <laughs> they were in, uh, was it Need for Speed, like the first? Yeah, that's, yeah. Ben, that's ex- exactly yep. how I know about that car, because I remember I would always pick that car, and I thought the dash was so cool in that yeah, car. I'd pick that, and I'd pick that Italian design Shigera. Y- yes, that one too. Yeah. <laughs> You did probably played the same game I did. <laughs> <laughs> I was just thinking about it the other day. I was playing Forza, and I was like, man, I wish they had the Ital design car on here. Yeah. That would, I remember yeah. I would spend hours driving that car on that game. <laughs> there was oh. a couple, Sorry, sorry, go ahead. Dan. No, no, it's all right. So we, we um, yeah, we bought two cars this week. So that was one car. That was planned. Yeah, and that one wasn't a mistake. That one went well. The, the other car is not a mistake. It's just... So, okay, so the other car, which I don't think we should tell anyone. I, yeah. Like, let's not tell anyone because I think that's a an interesting surprise. But um, we we're like, hey, you know, we should probably buy one of these cars. It makes sense. There's some stuff we could do on it, blah, blah, blah. And so we found one. It was like the right color combination, decent miles, condition looked great. And so we're like, let's just throw out a stupid low ball, right? Like, a okay. Stupid low ball. Yeah, like way lower than it was listed. And we're like, yeah, okay, we'll send it out. So then like a couple hours go by and we start doing some more digging on the car and we find out there's more things wrong with it than we thought. Like, I, I found uh, some service records. That yeah. Said some stuff that we were like, hmm. Yeah, it was, <laughs> nothing was Oops. catastrophic, 
<laughs> but it was enough that we're like, oh, man, we're going to have to do a lot of, like, we're going to have to do some work on this car. Like, if we get it, like, we'd have to actually, like, do some work. And so Josh and I were texting. We were all texting. And all of a sudden, we're like, you know, let's let's retract the bid and go lower because, like, we, we, we want a bigger margin because we're going to have to spend some money on it, right? And all of a sudden, the moment that we had this conversation, I log into the account and I'm like, hey, the car says sold. Oh, and, no. <laughs> and Josh, you know, Josh goes, I can't retract the bid. <laughs> and I'm like, huh, that's odd. Oh, hey, it says it's sold for exactly what we bid. Oh, shit. <laughs> and we're both like, oh, no. <laughs> We got it. <laughs> we we're like, oh, man. <laughs> well, I mean, the good news is we got it on the low ball. The bad news is, like, uh, we wanted to go lower. Yeah, yeah. We're like we should have gone lower, but we're like, I think oh, well. I think we'll be just fine, even if we, we have will. to fix. Should I say what 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 we found on it? Yes or no? And where'd you find it? So I found some service records that had been from the like I just found them on the internet on the on their website. The dealer that had it for sale retail. And it said that the heater core was bypassed. Ooh. And we don't know why. And then before it was bypassed or after it was bypassed, the car was overheating for some reason and they couldn't figure it out. But they finally Jeez. figured out it was a thermo or it was the water pump. So they replaced the water pump. But the thermo or the uh, heater core is bypassed and the heater doesn't work. So well, it's we don't know. It's it probably it's, bypassed because there's a leak in it. So it's, it's leaking probably. or it's clogged. Yeah. One of the two. Yeah, that, that's why it's clogged. Um, and then it, need, uh, it needs a major service. Yeah, it needs a major. Because Ferrari, in their infinite wisdom, put a bell on a V12. Is that what, 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 what the? What the Ferrari? I didn't know it was a Ferrari. You just gave it away. Oh, oh. no. <laughs> Nobody knew it was a Ferrari. Oops. No one knew it was a Ferrari. No one knew it was a V12. Why'd you do that? Oops. Who said it was a V12? He did. Did I say V12 at Ferrari? Yes. I and mean, then. I mean, Toyota in a four cylinder. <laughs> yeah. I meant Dodge ten cylinder. <laughs> oh my god! Well, it could be a very, it could be a. Hold I on. mean, there's a lot of V12 Ferraris. There. Come on. All right, all right, all right. Mistakes happen. All right. <laughs> That's too good. Uh, all right, Josh, you're, you're, you're fired. Plenty of V12 Ferraris. We still keep it secret. What's up? Is it an engine out, or can can it be done inside? You can't get that away. <laughs> <laughs> We're not going there. Yeah, We're not I, going I, there. I'll, I'll I'll put on the private chat after after. Yeah, there you go. After, there you after go. party. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, man. <laughs> oh man! Uh, you people make me nuts. <laughs> I need more wine. <laughs> Good Lord. Have fun. I'll be back in it. Please don't give away any more secrets. Yeah. I'm drinking the heavy stuff tonight. Ooh, nice. I've got the uh, quarter oh, yeah, case. Well. That's awesome. That's some yeah. real man scotch right there. It, I love it. I fucking love it. Yeah. I, I love the I love we got LaFroy here. So. Oh, there you go. A LaFroy is good too. Mm -hmm. Is today a, a scotch kind of day because he's got the well, it was National Beer Day, so I had to have a beer. And then uh, today is National Beer Day, apparently. I'm doing Glen Fiddick. Yeah, he's got single malt. Okay, it is Scotch. Day. Yeah, it's Scotch night. Scott, Scott, Scotch, and sparkling water. Yay! Yay. <laughs> and Adam's doing more. Adam's just a boy. Yeah, water, water, Coke, oh. or Sprite. Wait, uh, those are the three things I've ever seen you drink. So. <laughs> Yeah, we'll go with that. Okay. What secrets did you give away? <laughs> and then you got Dan with his wine. Yeah, <laughs> Italian wine. Because he drinks also, beer, but he drinks expensive wine. I also have a piece of bread. Ooh, Ooh. his pinky's up to the soak air up that wine. Yeah, uh, and I was supposed to get a baklava, and I, I don't know what this is. Uh, Looks like dried up sushi or something. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't look appetizing. It looks like like what a kid leaves over after he eats a cookie. Bin. Oh, just, shit. <laughs> My uh, screen thing got messed up. You, you really didn't get anything. Oh, there it goes. Yeah. Uh, I hope Megan Ash already ate out of that. 
<laughs> out of what? What you just opened. That wasn't like the whole thing from the restaurant, was it? Because <laughs> that's pretty pathetic. <laughs> I don't know what that is. What is, is that your what Uber driver's it? leftovers? <laughs> driver's leftovers. It definitely is not baklava. I'm very disappointed. Happy birthday yeah. to Dan. Oh, yeah. Well, that's this week. Yeah. Happy birthday. How old are you going to be? Seven hundred. We're not going to discuss that. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Are you eligible for AARP membership? No, I'm getting close, though. <laughs> Actually, it's a very special year. It's the meaning of life, the universe, and everything. Oh. What? Oh, that's you said 42. you weren't going to say it. Yeah. It's 42. Mm-hmm. How was 42 the meaning of life? Oh, Ben. Demote yeah, Ben. Man. Demote him. Yeah. Slide him over. I agree with Adam. <laughs> <laughs> I thought 69 was the meaning I'm working, of life. I'm working my way up. <laughs> now move me back up. See, 69 is the meaning of life. <laughs> I love Adam told everybody I have the temperature set at 69 degrees. Yeah. It's the most sexy, sex, 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 temperature. <laughs> Realize every time okay. he gets my truck, he sets the temperature to sixty nine. I really do. That's and then he looks at me and goes, "Nice." <laughs> I really do. He's not lying. So I'm, gonna do, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do that from now on. Every time I get in someone's yeah. car. Actually, I like Adam. You brought the Jag up here, and I hadn't really driven it. I got in the car with Steve to like. We went to Ben's house and do Lime Creek Road. I was like, "Oh, he set it to 69. <laughs> <laughs> you oh my got my address, will you? You want to just tell them more of the uh, screen? Uh, you said numbers. it before. You said that on live before. <laughs> yeah, I did set your air temperature to yes, 69. Yes, you did. Yep. 88 is better than 69. I agree. <laughs> you get eight yeah. twice. Finder's Guide of the Galaxy. Okay. Yeah. It's the most common mm-hmm. definition of 42 on Snapchat, WhatsApp, Facebook. Okay. <laughs> oh, I hear Megan. <laughs> oh. Hola, Megan. Hey, is Darth Vader yeah. being playing as she climbs the stairs? Uh, just doing mom stuff, and then I came because I finally got free. Nice. Oh. He's having like a growth spurt because he was like, he's doing some weird stuff today. <laughs> like he he took like he took a really long nap, like a two hour nap. Gets up. He's up for like 30 minutes and starts like rubbing his eyes and getting all groucho. And we're like, you need a nap? And so we put him down and he was out. No, like, he's only the last couple of days. I think he's, you know, I mean, this may or may not shock people. It shocks me because I'm tiny and Dan's not really all that big a person, but no, he's, he's like 85th, 90% of the, for weight on the, the percentile for the And he's, he's tall. Big boy. He's, and he's tall. He's tall. That's the more shocking thing. So far. Are either of your parents taller? No. Not mine. My dad's like six foot. Yeah, so that, that can be height height genes can skip a generation, they say. Yeah. Well, it wouldn't it wouldn't serve him poorly. It'd be okay. I mean, being a tall guy in the United States is not a bad thing. Mm-hmm. A taller guy. Oh, is he teething? Yeah. Yes. He's got two little bottom teeth. As much, really? And I know everybody finds the discussion of our baby and his dentition very yeah. riveting. But sorry to interrupt. I didn't know he had <laughs> teeth. Yeah, he's got two teeth exactly. Little bottom ones. <laughs> and he's bit us too. Like, you know, he's like, ha ha. He's like, grabs your fingers, like, ha ha. Argh. I'd be like, ah, jeez. Oh. A gremlin? <laughs> yep. <laughs> Yeah, she is smarter than me. She brought the bottle up. Oh, Travis knows the lingo. It's a leap, like a generation of brain development. That yeah, no, I've heard. I I don't know. I have those apps on my phone that talk about leaps, but I was like, eh. unless something goes terribly wrong, it could be. Yeah, you could be right. It could be from the teething. I don't know. He he just all of a sudden like this week he was like, I'm gonna take a very short period of time where I'm awake and just nap super hard, like. Anyway, no. I, know, I know everyone's super in. Anyway, cars. Yeah. Gabe, Back to cars. Super oh. cars. Gabe, they won't let me babysit. <laughs> oh, I'm very sure he no, did not offer. Dude, Adam, are you kidding me? Adam's, Adam's got a phobia of our baby. He Adam's got a phobia of all babies. 
Yeah. I like GT like... Pro's comment. I'm sure everybody's seen that video. Oh, yeah. Oh, <laughs> Charlie. <laughs> Charlie. <laughs> God. Oh, we have those little uh, rings. Yeah, the teething rings. You've got every teething item. Like Amazon, like same day delivery <laughs> or uh, whatever. It's like cause when you're trying to watch a baby oh, all the time. Ash College Fund. Thank you. Oh, <laughs> thank you. That's very sweet. That is something that we are doing. Yeah, we know it's funny. Legitimately, we, we started a college fund for him long before we ever decided he was going to exist. So now we have one. Yeah, did you know for any of you that are not with kid and someday might have a kid, you can actually do a 529 plan for your spouse. So, what we did is we set up a 529 plan for Megan. And then as soon as Ash was born, we got a social security number. We transferred it to Ash. <clears throat> are awesome. no, there's no tax penalties, no nothing, blah, blah, blah. So we we, we actually had a 529 29 plan for over a decade nice. prior to Ash existing. Yeah. So what happens, like, if, what happens huh? if you don't end up not having a kid? And So, I mean, worst case scenario is you end up with a pile of money that you might get some taxes on. Yep, you withdraw it and you get taxed on it. Right. Yeah. We were like, that's a pretty great, that's a pretty low risk uh, thing for us to do. And Supercars by the Sea is uh, most certainly referring to Sophie the Giraffe. And yes, he has, he has more than one Sophie. Yes. <laughs> I'm glad that I don't know what that is. <laughs> it's just I'm a little sorry. rubber giraffe the babies chew yeah. on. Yeah. Awkwardly enough, I do. And I don't have kids. So. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but all my friends had multiples of them as well. Yeah. So. Sophie I forgot is, about Sophie, Sophie when you said it. Yeah, that's awesome. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, yeah, it's been a, quite the week between two cars. We were out at EAG. Spilling the beans on one of the cars. Mm, both of them. No, we planned to tell them about the first one. Did we? The, yeah. <laughs> The second one, I admit, I let slip. Nobody's perfect. Yeah. Let's not talk about that You're anymore. Because you might split, let more slip. Yeah. yeah. How's it's the new job going, Meg? I think it's going well. Dan and I, uh, like, t did a did a staff meeting earlier this week. <laughs> staff. Well, yeah. I don't want to hear about y'all staff meetings. Yeah. No, it wasn't. That's what that they call it—a staff. How tall was the staff? <laughs> <laughs> About three inches. <laughs> Give me a lot of credit. <laughs> hey man, whatever it did, it did the job. But um, so uh, yeah, no. So Dan is taking a sh like it's very fatiguing, like watching the baby all day and trying to do work stuff. So Dan is going to take a shift midday that allows mm -hmm. me to just like refocus on something different. Which right now I'm uploading many Porsche products to normalguyssupercar.com. Um, Dude, and... you should hear her complaining about, why the hell are they all named the same damn thing? Like, <laughs> right now, like there's so many iterations of Porsche 997. <laughs> No, yeah, of course, 911. Yeah, yeah, but even worse. Don't yeah. bother, Adam. Don't bother. Yeah. No. <laughs> Dude, it's so funny because she'll be sitting there. I'll be watching him, and she's working on the computer, and she's like, what the hell is this? This is the same thing as the last one. I'm like, no, it's not. Well, it says the same damn thing. I'm like, well, there's one letter that's different. Well, then what the hell? <laughs> but, and uh, so, yeah, no, I mean, it's it's going well. I really enjoy, like I said, I like being with my husband. I love being with my baby. And uh, the, the work I do with normal guy is very low stress. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, it's, a, it's, a, it's radically different than running a mental health clinic. Yeah. <laughs> I love Charlie's comment. Thank you. Thank you for that. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah. No kidding, right? 911, 981.2, 991.992.1. 992.3 doesn't exist yet. <laughs> it will. It's never... They've never done a dot three though. They've never done a dot Just three. Wait. <laughs> yeah, actually, um, so we do carry, excuse me, a ton of Porsche stuff. We just don't have it on the website yet because the problem with Porsche is they've been making cars for 
forever. So is Ferrari. It's yeah, not- but there's like not that many models because Ferrari doesn't change models very often. Yeah, there is like when Ferrari you had generations of, the car, of a specific car, then you could do that. Right. So Porsche yeah. changes. They'll have the same car and they'll iterate it. Yep. New generation. And then, and then they'll have a different damn exhaust because they're like, oh, we changed one thing and it needs a different exhaust. I'm like, well, oh. but I mean, 99, say 996.1 and two, but then 997 is a completely different, it's a new car. Yeah, I know. Thing, you know. But like to do all the products for that is well, a I lot of legwork. I don't oh, mind that. Would you have liked it if Porsche just had 30 different models instead? It'd be easier to figure out. It'd be easier to it is no like legitimately try, like as someone who's not into the car world trying yeah, to yeah, explain yeah. them. That makes sense. Well, you see, these are all the same thing, but they're not the same because this one number is different. And oh, but actually, they make the same thing, but then some of them are GTs and some of them are Carreras and some of them are GT3s and some of them are GT2s and some of them are Carrera S's. And this one's different because yeah. it's a turbo. And so I'm like. You left the GTS out, by the way. Okay. So, yeah, <laughs> exactly. Exactly. It's real. But GTS is a new one that didn't exist in the last couple of generations ago. Highlight, yeah. Oh, yeah. Jeez. <laughs> you should absolutely yes, do it. come on the Colorado trip. She's no, listening yes. right now while working. You need do to go on the trip. Adam's That's wife has gone multiple times. She has yes. a really fun time. It is good, even if you're not about the car. It's, it's not. Yeah. I mean, yes, it's a car tour, but it's also a tour where we're stopping and sightseeing and eating good food and staying, staying at amazing. really lovely yeah. hotels. Yeah, it's a luxury yeah. tour. It's a luxury vacation yeah. that is in your car. Your car is transportation to all the different destinations, which we do at rapid speeds. <laughs> it's spirited speed. Spirit. Yeah. yeah. The in speed limit. Car. Of but course. you don't have to do that if you don't want to, because we have waypoints like every I don't know fifty miles, and yeah, so yeah, Stu yeah. and Destiny went their own way a couple of different days. Right? Oh yeah, yeah, a yeah. couple mm-hmm. times they were just like, "We're going to do our own thing." We're like, "Cool, we'll see you at the next uh, stop." And they showed yeah. up. Now, if for certain you can do it with significant others, I'm not taking my eight month old. That's not a thing. <laughs> no. But uh, I think I think significant others could easily enjoy it. Oh yeah, no. Even if you're not a car person, the only thing is you would need to be able to tolerate being in the car for an extended period of time and potentially going at fun speeds. But yeah. but when we say extended period of time, you have to remember that we're all in cars with fairly small gas tanks going at. Yeah, yeah. we're stopping every. Yeah. The longest so we hours. ever go is two hours. Yeah, it's yeah. You're in the car for two hours at the most at, at any one time, so you can get yeah. out and stretch and everything like that. So, don't think you're going to be cooped up in the car for like eight or nine hours. <laughs> if Ben Wiki uh, like and, and for Richard goes, we're in. Well, I'm going. One, of the three, one of the three is in. Ven's yeah. not going to go because he's a loser, and I'm not. Yeah. I don't think I'm Richard's going. Go. That's why I'm not going. <laughs> oh, <laughs> except for the trip that you're going on instead. Yeah, see, I moved Ben can want to go see North Carolina. It's a pretty state. Oh, I'm excited about that. <laughs> I had a dream that I wanted to drive like that with a bunch of lost people. I mean, good job. <laughs> 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 I'm self-deprecating nature of that the sound man. Bad. I know. Road. What's wrong with the Waffle House, dude? That's Waffle it, House. Hey, is yeah, that awesome. doesn't sound like a I, bad I have, trip. So many road trips have stopped at Waffle Houses. Every time you leave the Waffle House, going, "Why the hell did I eat a Waffle House?" <laughs> we <laughs> ate at Waffle's house when we picked up Timmy's Ferrari. Right, and when we left, we we're all going, "God, why do we do that?" <laughs> no, I wasn't like that. I loved it. There's an episode of Anthony Bourdain eating at Waffle House, and he's like, "This is legit good food." You know, and it's <laughs> day. if he said that, you know, it's got to be good then, yeah. right? Yeah, it's so bad. <laughs> So if by bad you mean good. <laughs> Great. No. No, it's I was going to ask Adam, did you like MREs when you were in the yeah. military? I like some of them. I didn't. Uh, and um, your your opinion on food does not count. <laughs> <laughs> the jumble <laughs> the jambalaya MRE was trash. Oh, I can't imagine that would be good. Yeah. yeah. Oh. Well, because they give you that little bottle of Tabasco in every single oh. one, and you just douse it in Tabasco. Did you get your um, exhaust installed yet, Greg? 
because I want to hear that. Oh, it's Greg. Hey, what's up, Greg? Oh, oh, it just got there. Oh, nice. Oh, you got it on. It's up. Dude, I nice. need to hear that. Yeah, no kidding. When are you going <laughs> to hair soap? And if somebody else wants a Porsche exhaust, part of the staff here at NGS is is uploading many products we can get you in. The when are you going to buzz my house, Greg? <laughs> <laughs> Greg buzzes my house in his 430 all the time, and it sounds like heaven. He, he, it screeches past my house. It is awesome. <laughs> Dude, as oh, much nice. as I love your – as long as just a, uh, I love cars, I could not live where you live. Oh, that see, really you're not a cool. true car, you know, a gearhead. I'm a true gearhead. Okay. <laughs> okay, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Adam's Adam's a 70 year old dude stuck in a 30 year old dude's body. <laughs> you're I'm not like, wrong. Get off my lawn. <laughs> <laughs> you're not wrong. Je was it Jeopardy? No. What is it? What shirt do you want? Jeopardy. Jeopardy. Jeopardy is his shirt. It's shit. time for Jeopardy. Get off my lawn. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Get off my lawn and get okay. my tractor out of well, the mud. This is very important. <laughs> Fun fact, fun fact for all of you that don't know this. This is this is not a lie. Adam has a thing for Jeopardy. And every day at four o'clock. Why do like, you all act like this is a bad thing? It's not. I'm just it's saying. not, it's just funny. It's just funny. It's just funny. <laughs> like uh, you're you're obsessed with Jeopardy and you're like, oh, it's four o'clock, gotta stop. I gotta, well, I gotta like, like, one day. He has to watch it live. He's yeah, so oh, I don't have a DVR. I only have over the air. So you have internet and a computer. <laughs> But today, Josh was like, oh, we should get a Facebook page for the dealership. And I was like, and this was at like 3.58. Yeah, and Adam and responds I, and says, I need to watch Jeopardy first. <laughs> I, I said, I'll do it, but I have to watch Jeopardy. <laughs> oh, oh, speaking of that, if you haven't already, go follow our Facebook page, NG Supercars, and Instagram, NG dot Supercars, because NG Supercars was taken. What? Can you buy it? I don't know. <laughs> now, do I want to pay for that? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, yeah. See, there these people get it. Jeopardy is one of the greatest shows on TV. Jeopardy is awesome. I have nothing. Oh, even my brother said Jeopardy all. is legit. I have nothing all. against Jeopardy. I think I don't it's have anything I just find it. it very fascinating. Your obsession <laughs> with it is very strong. Just I wait like until I find out. Sean Connery was on there. <laughs> <laughs> Those skits were great. <laughs> Suck it, Trebek. Your mom was great. <laughs> oh, didn't. Oh, I, I need Tyler's thing for that. Yeah. Can you think do that Here. while you're doing this? Oh, yeah. Do it. Do it. He's got his soundboard going. Yeah, on. yeah. Hey! <laughs> all right, you gotta be uh, you gotta be on the ball. For yeah, that. all right, I gotta like, bring this a little closer. <laughs> that would be, you won't have to do much because you guys aren't that funny. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Tyler, that hit it! Hit it! Hit it! Hit it! Come on! It's not. We yeah, <laughs> I did it right when she said it. Did you not hear it? No, no. it didn't go through. Oh. He's got canned oh. laughter too. Yeah, yeah. Hey Dan, as well as the comedy is. <laughs> <laughs> Say it again. No. Dan, Dan, what's the secret to comedy? I don't know. Timing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. This show oh, just got much better. <laughs> yeah. I don't know about that. We need Josh. We need Josh. Actually, I need to legitimately ask Josh to be on a live again sometime because, oh man, do you want us to get demonetized? Yeah. Uh, you know, you can't demonetize someone for quacks. Well, you go. oh, you mean on the live? On the live. Yeah. I turned off the uh, noise suppression so it shouldn't cancel it out now. Ah, oh, there you go. So now we're yeah. good. I need to get. I have to say, I'm super jealous of the microphones you have. Those are amazing. I live down the street, man. Yeah, I know. When I move, Worst people. Yeah, you'll be super close. <laughs> Once I move, actually, I I need to uh, hire you to help me set up a studio because I have a new office and I want to set up with like sound walls yeah. and all that stuff. Oh, I need uh, you to send me the quack file and then I can load it into. That. I was that's what I was oh. about to ask before Josh joins the live. We need to get yeah. Tyler the quack file so that he can just sit there. And just <laughs> we have to put a delay on it and let Tyler edit on the go. Yeah, yeah. Today's video with Josh was one of my favorite videos ever. Not, oh not only yeah. because 
he was an authentic person, but people were like, man, I lost respect for you. No, excuse me. Almost 99 times out of 100, when you're talking about a service industry person versus a consumer of luxury products, I'm going to come down on the side of the service industry person. <laughs> like, I, I deeply empathize. I, yeah, no, like, I, Josh, I take his side every time. He, he is not the Ferrari owner. He's not driving home to a mansion. He is a skilled professional. Um, and he's not, he's not like, you know, in poverty, but it, it, I'm going to come down on Josh's side every time. <laughs> Seems like uh, anybody that's complaining about that video is probably the who that video is made about. <laughs> that's what we were right? saying. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, the chicken finger guy. <laughs> There's somebody out there with bit. chicken oh finger who got him those chicken fingers who is deeply hurt today. Oh yeah, oh yeah. I don't know who that chicken finger person. By is. the way, okay, since Josh is definitely not watching this right now, so Meg and I came up with an agreement. Yeah. The next, Charlie, like, it's a stove. like, huh? He keeps yeah. asking. I'm sorry, Charlie. It's a stove. And he no, said no. earlier. Oh yeah. You just need a background. sign that says stove and tape it to it. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> The next like five times Josh is in our videos, we need to just like have like chicken fingers sitting there. I think that that's got oh, longer yes. legs than five times. I think yeah. I'm bringing oh, yeah. chicken just fingers every forever. time I get together with Every Josh single time Josh is on, uh, yeah. Shit, we gotta stop and get chicken fingers. Mm -hmm. <laughs> can you get one of oh, those yeah. flags printed that just says chicken fingers? And no, no like you don't even, in the garage? don't even bring attention to it. You just have chicken fingers in the okay, background. Just somewhere in the back. I love yeah, it. it's yeah. like it'll be one of those ongoing jokes for the rest of the existence of this channel. So just hey. Every time that you see Josh at some point in the video, chicken fingers will appear. Is Why are they called on Saturday? I have an important oh, question. If he is, you need to make sure chicken fingers happen. Oh, yes. yes. Chickens don't have fingers, so where do chicken fingers come well, from? Fish They're don't either. Well, yeah, here we are with some fish fingers. There's well, no there's such thing as a fish finger. They don't have sticks. Yeah, sticks. Made them. sticks. You're, you're obviously not well traveled, Adam. <laughs> Well traveled to Long John Silver's. Yeah, exactly. That's what I meant. <laughs> no, I don't eat seafood. Is everyone going to Mozart's on Saturday? Yes. I am not because I oh. live close to Circuit of the Americas and MotoGP is going to be here. And every road near where I live is completely crammed with traffic. So, uh, excuses. Yeah. Yep. You're right. We're, going, we were, All right. we were really disappointed. We were going to try and bring the boat. That was the goal. Yeah, it ain't gonna make it. Had the, I, had the Jay's, boat been ready, I would have toughed out the traffic. Yeah, <laughs> Jay's not in the comments, so I, I figured the boat wasn't ready. Yeah, um, yeah I mean, I, I'm just joking, but and we still have to put it together too. Which yeah, yeah, once it's done, we still got put, which takes probably the better part of a day. Yep. So, the buffaloes don't have wings. Very valid. Yeah. See, you have buffalo wings. Wait a minute! You're letting Des take your He's 360. He's not letting her do anything. Well, okay, fine. You're having oh, Des drive the 360. <laughs> Correction of sustain. Dan, let me eat today. Uh, I like how Stu says, "Pray for her, not pray for me." Uh huh. Yeah. <laughs> Should it be like, "Pray for your car"? I'm just saying. No, wait, wait, wait. She drove it a bunch on the tour. The rally. Yep. So, or maybe the car is just a uh, maybe the top one would work again. So it's just a taking back about <laughs> it's a pay for her. Oh man, I don't just because what... Elon currently resides here sometimes. He's not, not an Austinite. Yeah. Austinite. Yeah, he doesn't count. Yeah. yeah. And I'm glad he bought part of Twitter. I think it's hilarious. Yeah, yeah. I, he just, I, I agree. It's like if you looked at his poll, seventy percent of over 2 million people that voted said that Twitter is basically shutting That's people down. Funny. Okay, never mind. <laughs> yeah. I think it's just funny that somebody can buy part of a company just to say fuck so you. So how about them bears? <laughs> how about them bears? How about the them bears? Bears. Oh, bears. <laughs> the bears. bears. I should show I wonder if I get John, you're not you're not you you are correct on that. <laughs> All right, I'll okay. do. I'll do. I'll do. Everyone who still like tolerated this and still hanging out with us is solid. 
I'm going to pull up a picture of the uh, one of the two purchases this week. If I can the find McLaren. It. I got some easy ones. I got some on my phone. Uh, I just Tyler, start there. the drum roll. Start the drum roll. Do you have a drum roll? Uh, Here you go. All right. Ready? <laughs> this ready is supposed to, we're supposed There's to no, see this on, no drum roll. on uh, Monday, right? Oh, you already have it. Yeah. There it okay. is. Oh, uh, yeah. Hell yeah. Nice. I'm so excited, dude. I am there. So I got one of the interior. Here you go. Nice. Nice. And the yeah. rear. Sweet. Now I got to come down again. Yeah. <laughs> Here, here's I'll, a I'll picture Monday and check it out. of Luke pushing a button at CNC since I totally left <laughs> out. I have to Ooh. show a picture. Oh. There you go. <laughs> oh. It's usually bad when people text me during the live. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, I, I, I'm curious. I like the last time I drove a 12C was before I owned my first Ferrari. So it'll be, it'll be interesting because now I've driven. <laughs> Growth. Jeez. I'm, oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Travis. <laughs> I'm not even going to look, Travis. What color is it? It's like the, um, I think it's Volcano Red or something. Isn't that what they call it? I'm looking it's at the like color. So. I'm curious because everybody keeps think, asking, what color is it? I think it's called Volcano Red. It's like metallic red. It's like a, it's a very deep red. It's not a, it's not a bright red like a Ferrari red, like a Rosa Corsa. It's a very deep. Um, looks like they call it uh, Mercury Red. It looks very similar to Tyler's car, color wise. Kind of. I mean, that's the official. To... That's the official color. You I'm should sure call it candy apple more red. Do it, candy candy. apple. That's or it might be it might be volcanic red. I thought I think it, it's well, volcanic, volcanic red. orange. I know there's volcanic well, they have, orange. They have uh, they have volcanic orange and volcanic red. I think it's volcanic oh. red. Yeah, volcanic orange is like similar to Steve's old uh, 1M. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. It's not the exact color, but it's pretty similar. Mm -hmm. Yeah. No, I mean. I, Hopefully it's a good car because it everything about it we can read so far is good. Oh, here here's something funny. You guys will you guys will find this entertaining. So we bought on the wholesale market through Mannheim, and uh, so we paid the extra money to get what they call a post purchase inspection, basically like or PSI, right? Post, post sale, sale. yeah. PSI. So it's like I don't know, seven hundred bucks, six hundred bucks, whatever. And basically, it like they look the car over, and it gives you 14 days to like if anything's wrong with the car that they didn't know, you can return the car or get, oh, wow. get your money back, whatever. So we paid that money. We're like, hey, this is great. Like we're yeah, gonna get a McLaren, and we have we're making a days. smart decision, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah, oh, this is this is awesome. Worst case scenario, we're out 650 bucks or whatever it is. So they email us the next day, like, yeah, um, you can't do that on a McLaren. <laughs> <laughs> they so PSI doesn't exist for a McLaren. They can't like, get like, a PSI on a McLaren, and they have a like, list of other cars that that they won't do it on. Could you uh, describe some of them? Uh, uh, they're all supercars. One of them was like a, a Mercedes G wagon, uh, any Lamborghini, any Ferrari, um, any Ferrari, any, any Ferrari, any, any McLaren. Any car, they said any car that has a production run of less than four thousand. Yeah, and any and car that any. has an average auction value of eighty thousand or more. So most Porsches too, then. Yeah, most, nine, nice they Porsches. specifically yep. say nine elevens can mm -hmm. get wow. it done. Jeez. I think it's they're just covering their ass because if they don't really, those technicians don't know the cars well enough to right. do a full inspection on them, and so if they miss something, then it's on Mannheim. It's not on right. the seller. So they don't want to. I mean, I don't blame them. Yeah, yeah. We were like, "Oh, this is great," and then pff, it ran through. It ran through the block green light, which means it's ride yeah. and drive. If we were there in person and we drove it away and it blew up, we could take it back. So I'm confident that it's fine. Even a McLaren. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yep. So you have, what you lights? Have, what lights do they have? The green light. What else? They have green light. They have yellow light, which means there's an announcement. So they'll say yellow light, maybe a transmission bad or engine knocking or something like that. And then red light is as is. You're buying. You know, there's probably something wrong with it, but you take it and it's yours. What is a lambda sensor? You'll have so to go to. It. It. <laughs> oh, I, okay. I won't tell. I Let her I Google it. <laughs> but don't misspell lambda. Don't no. let it autocorrect to. 
oh, something. Yeah. Actually, yeah, you're right. Uh, oops. Well, oh, shit. Oh, God dang it. I'm clicking buttons. Little man it. needs some milk. Okay. He woke up. Stuart, I'll do it if you'll pay for the gas. Yeah. <laughs> I'll go with. Where, where is it located, Josh? Uh, it's um, coming from California. Oh, nice. What? McLaren? Is it, no, no North Florida. Carolina. Sorry. Fuck, I don't no, know. We've got North so many Carolina. cars that are coming North from Carolina. all over the place. North Carolina. <laughs> North, yeah. Okay, North Carolina. The the other car is coming from California. No, no the other one's coming from Georgia. Georgia. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> because we yeah. thought that he the might stop on the way from there. California. The 430 yes. came from California. Yeah. So how, how do you guys manage to ship in cars so quick? Like, I've got a, awesome. So I've, I've been using a, a company that I've used for like 15 years for shipping cars. And so they treat me really well. And I know the owner of the company. So they give me priority. And is that who's shipping Claudia's too? Yes. Yeah, badass. Oh, awesome. and, and they're going to um, set up so that we can actually start yeah, so they're girls. They're building oh, us cool. a website right now with our logo and stuff. So anybody out there that wants a shipping quote can type in their info awesome. and they'll quote them. And awesome. yeah. Nice. So if you uh, want to tow your vehicle to Colorado for the devaluation yeah. tour, once that hopefully that'll is be up and running, we'll give it out. Hopefully it'll be up next week. That'd be sweet. Yeah. Well, I have an empty trailer coming back from Florida, so we can talk afterwards. Oh, what are you going? Uh, on the 11th, I'm going down to bring the stuff. Mm. 11th to, to Florida. Um, You're going to the Florida on the 11th. When do you, when do you think you'd be heading back? 14th or the 15th? Oh, okay. Probably too late. Okay. <laughs> Immediately, Dan starts looking at cars in Florida specifically to buy. <laughs> no, no, we're we're tapped out. We're like out of money now. <laughs> but no, I was more I was more thinking. Hey, if he wants to make a detour, could pick up the car in Georgia, drive it here, and then he could pick up his Super G, and then make a big I triangle. Will happily pay for your gas. You're right, and exactly, yeah, I'd pay him. No problem, because I'm sure it's cheaper than... Well, we might have another car coming from Boston. That's not too far from where you're at, is it? No. Yeah, if his trailer's full, going to Florida. Oh, okay. It, it is kind of out of the way. <laughs> I got to go yeah. north for six hours before I can... Oh, six Ooh, hours, yeah. Six hours. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> yeah. Steve, yeah, we got to... where you are again? I'm sorry? Well, remind us where you are again? I'm, I'm right next to Gettysburg, Pennsylvania. Gabe could drive it to you. Mm -hmm. There you go. Then and he would can... love to do yeah. that too. Yeah, right. yeah. Well, that's oh, another deal. Let's make this more complicated. <laughs> right. Charlie's in Boston. Hey, we're we're probably basically buying a car in Boston, so it's probably going to be a. Actually, he just texted or emailed us, and and won't be till the end of the month. Yeah, I talked to him earlier. He said he, he, the service is like two more weeks. So. Yeah, it was supposed to. It was supposed to be done this next week, but they're not going to have it done for a couple weeks. So, oh, here you go. Out for us, so. I like this. This is a good question. If you had a budget of one seventy-five to three hundred, what huge car budget. would you buy? Yeah, no kidding. <laughs> that's right. a that's a good range. Yeah. There are a lot of options in that range. What what yeah. mark would you like to go with, Charlie? Yeah. Because I mean, there's there's certainly Ferrari options, there's Lamborghini options, there's yeah. Porsche. I'd probably options. I'd probably do a nice spec four five eight with low four miles on it. Yeah. Four five eight, or if you wanted a twelve, get like an eight eight twelve. You know, super yeah. fast. Um, you could, yeah, you could actually get like get an F twelve. Yeah, an F twelve. Yes, eight twelve would be hard. Eight twelve, I don't think you can get sub three hundred. Yeah. F twelve. Okay. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, what are we gonna do with what? Which what what? Greg, we're gonna sell it. Yeah, <laughs> oh, the car. Yeah, we have. So the car, the McLaren, we're just gonna sell. Um, we'll probably clean it up a little bit because I think it's probably not perfect. But there's not much we're gonna do to it because you keep. Unfortunately, like we can't do much to the car because we don't have the computers. We don't have like getting parts for it are damn near impossible. But the other car, we have some serious plans for. So, yeah. Serious plans. Yeah. <laughs> oh, sorry. Yes. <laughs> He's like, no, if he wants to buy a car, what car does he want to do with it? Oh, yeah. Sorry. Totally misread that question. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Valid. True. Yeah. Um, 
Well, wait, you just said 175. <laughs> Um, let's see if you want to go Lamborghini, uh, you know, nice Huracan be probably sub 200, right? Mm. I don't think you can, you can get a yeah. higher mile, like first year okay. one for, for 200. So maybe, yeah. so maybe 250 yeah. will get you a nice Huracan. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, it's in the same category as a 458. Yeah. Mm -hmm. so 458 is going to hold its value better. Yeah. Oh, much better. Um, so far the 430 has not sold. So we'll see. Well, I think it's sold. Actually, the yeah. guy just sent me a text. Did he? Yeah. Yeah. He asked just when we can meet tomorrow. Oh. <laughs> is, this the, is this the guy After with the, the wire deal? clears? Is this the yeah. shady cash deal? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Badass. Uh, we can meet after the cut, the wire clears. Yeah, exactly. He's going right. to bring you $100 bills. The top one and the bottom one will be real bills. The rest will be all fake. You know? yeah. <laughs> well, he wanted to bring cash tonight, and I was like, dude, no. No, no. <laughs> For a lot of reasons, no. <laughs> yeah. I don't want to, like, I don't ever want to deal with $100,000 in physical cash. So, how does, how does that work for, um, for a uh, used car dealer, like I know when, when if you go into a uh, like regular car dealership and buy a car in cash, if you pay them over say ten thousand dollars, I think the number is ten thousand dollars. It's a business. It's a business account, so it's. I don't think it's reported to the IRS. Like if it's a no, personal account, but like a car dealership has to report it. Oh cash. right, yeah. If we take yeah. it, oh, more than ten k in cash, we do have to report yeah. to the IRS. Yeah, yes. there's a CPR, oh, wow. and then it's something to do with the uh, Patriot Act or something. Yeah. Where, yep. Yep. yep, that's yep. why we just don't want to deal with it. Yep. And, yeah, and I don't want like, to do that. I don't want. I don't want. First of all, I don't want to be like. You know how nervous I'd be driving around with that much yeah. money. Like, <laughs> holy just crap, call me, dude! I'll show up. You know, guns a blazing. <laughs> <laughs> right? Seriously, I would. I would be like, okay. Well, it's not only that. It's like. If somebody hands me that much money, I want to make sure the money's real, right? Because right. who has that much money? I don't know. I don't have yeah, one of those special you, pens you, and shit. I'm not going to like might, write a. What do you do? Count every single bill? No, so yeah. here's what you do for stuff like that. Um, you have them meet you at your bank and have the yeah. bank deposit yeah. right away. Yeah. yeah. And if they refuse to do that, that's fake. Yeah. Well, in either way, honest to God, if someone's got yeah. cash, I'd be like, just send us a wire. It's not hard. You yeah, call you your bank and you go, money. hey, send them a wire. Here's their information. Unless there's some reason you can't deposit your right. money in a and, bank. And here's the thing. like <laughs> as, as a legitimate dealership, we, we have certain regulations. We have to like we have to put people's information into a system to make sure that they're not on like the FBI's wanted list or whatever, some shit. So like we can't like like if someone's trying to like subvert the process by paying cash, that doesn't like no. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Yeah. No. What's what, there was a movie with? Uh, in, I want to say it was in the '90s with uh, DMX buying a Lamborghini with cash. You know what I'm talking about? Where he goes in with his buddy and they're they're dressed like rap, like you know, gangsters into a Lamborghini dealership, and and, and like the dealership salesman treats him like shit, and then the other salesman comes and he goes, uh, "Let me let me show you this car." He pulls out a bag of cash and yeah. there and drives off in the Lamborghini. That was Pretty <laughs> Woman in, in the, the store. store. Not pretty Woman. Let me look at it. I want to, I want, like, legitimately, this is a legit question. Who the hell wants to run around with big piles of cash? Like, what kind of crappy dollars? It's nerve wracking. Like, it's, it's people who have no concept of, well, like, actual think about if, if you have $50 million in the bank, $100 million in the bank, and you have 100 grand cash, it's like us walking around with a $20 bill in but our pocket. Why? You know? But why? Physically, why? Yeah. Why I mean, not? What's the name? Why <laughs> not? Who likes to have a million dollars in cash in it at all times? <laughs> if, if I if I have a hundred million dollars in the bank, I'm gonna walk around with the Amex Black and be like, charge that bitch. Yeah. Well, <laughs> if you have you know, if you have a hundred million in the bank, you probably earned it. Someone that's carrying around that money probably didn't earn it. True. Okay. I well, they earned it. Yeah. They just they don't have the respect streets. for it. That <laughs> yeah, they don't have no, maybe no maybe you're right. So that's the thing. Like, if someone's got that much cash, it makes me think. Okay, like you probably didn't earn it legally, or I'm not sure I want to deal with it's your money. It's probably la laundering. Like they probably got it in whatever, and they buy a car with it, and they ways. can go and sell that car and say, "Hey, yeah, I sold my the car." The serial numbers on the bills are connected to a murder or something. Yeah, right. <laughs> like Why are these bills all sequential? Yeah, yeah right. <laughs>
Is this Weird. Die normal? I do have a thing for sequential bills, guys. I will say. I've well, I've I, randomly I, gotten some from a bank, yeah. and it's pretty cool. I have. Uh, I went to the bank once just for fun. To, I asked for two dollar bills, and she pulled out a whole stack of brand new two dollar bills. So I gave her two hundred dollars, and put, <laughs> I have a hundred sequential two dollar bills now. I love you it. Going nice. to strip club there. <laughs> I give my kids dollar... two dollar bills when they lose their teeth. <laughs> Your wife withdrew forty thousand dollars cash to avoid an eight dollar cashier's check fee. Oh, that's stupid. Why is your own bank is, charging you a cashier's a bank, check? I was going to say the same thing. If you're doing a forty thousand dollar cashier's check, they should waive that. It, it depends. It depends on what their account is. Chase has three levels. So if you're at the highest level, you have to have a certain amount of money in the bank, and then they don't charge for anything. You can do anything you want with them. They'll cut you as many checks as you want. They'll wire anything for free. And then they have a middle level that if you have a certain amount of money, then they'll do some things for free. And if you're at the base level that, you know, if you just open up a free checking account, then they charge you for everything. So well, that's that same dumb. top level can call Josh on Sundays. Wells Fargo. <laughs> chicken <laughs> finger level. We use Wells Fargo and they'll give me a cashier's check for anything. So Wells Fargo sucks. <laughs> Chase does too. But I have a <laughs> They all suck. Yeah. I, have to, I mean, like, I don't know. I, I guess just because of the nature of having done business for enough years now, it's like, to me, cash is like, I don't want to deal with it. I don't want cash. I don't even want checks. I want a wire transfer, period. Yeah. Like, I don't even like ACHs because you can claw back an ACH. So I don't know. I mean, I send, because of normal guy, we send out probably 10 wires a month. You get charged a wire fee by your bank? Yes. Yeah. It's like but 15 it's part bucks. of doing business. It's part yeah. of oh, business. Yeah, no, when you're sending out yeah, 10, 20, 50, 100,000 dollar wires, yeah. Well, have, what do we where do you, where is it that Klein is? Oh, Klein, every time They only deal in wires. Yeah, no, all it's almost smart. all of the exhaust smart. companies we deal with, they're in international co uh, companies. All of them require a wire. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. They won't deal with anything else but a wire. Yep. Like, nope, you can't send us a check. You can't charge it. You can't ACH it. We want a wire. Hmm. So I'm saying the only out problem wire. with a wire is there's a delay, like a two, yep. three hour delay. Sometimes yeah. that's annoying. That's where cryptocurrency comes in. Well, <laughs> but that's a lot faster. Than plug I got to plug. I got to plug it. Yeah. If, but if, hey, you if do someone wants to buy a car from us with Bitcoin, I'm done. No. Let's do it. No. no. Yeah. Please no. no. Not with my money. <laughs> I'll convert it into cash for you, so you're you're not. You We've know. talked about this once before. You guys, Dan, you said if Josh handles it, we would do it. Because I was like, no, no, no. You would, to, totally. you would have to cash it, turn it into dollars. Yes, immediately. It can happen instantly. Yep. Yeah, you well, get to charge some fees, but not bad. Yeah, no, I just like read much. a. You know what? We watched a documentary about a Canadian cryptocurrency oh, like, yeah. exchange that went out yeah. of business. The Ponzi ran scheme off of 200 guy. million dollars. Oh, yeah, Count Gox. Is that what you're talking about? Uh, something it was a Canadian guy, a Canadian Real dude, yeah, goofy it was Mark on Zuckerberg Netflix. looking guy, and he died. <laughs> died in India, supposedly. Died, yes, died. And I have to say, I do, I do wonder why can't they make an instantaneous bank to bank transfer? Because the Fed has to put their little dick beaters in everything. I guess so, but it's so stupid. Like it's like when we buy cars, we send wires. Like when we were buying the 430, Fred was out there physically at the car. We had to send a wire, and it took two hours. Well, that's why that's why cryptocurrency was invented in the first place. One of the reasons is because it's instant. Like if is I wanted so? to send you a million dollars, you'd you'd have that million dollars in in two or three and it's, minutes. And it's irre irreversible. You cannot charge. And it's that. irreversible and it's traceable. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, they need something like that for actual money, though. Instead yeah, of like they do of electrons. Uh, it's coming. It's coming. Yeah. It, it'll be here. Yeah, that will that will make life a lot because it's stupid. Like, why why on earth does it cost me forty five dollars or whatever it costs to send a wire? That should be rolled into the customer's cost. Is that it? is that yeah, because that's why we charge a dock fee? Is there no? But that's that's also like when we sell a exhaust. Why there's got to be a markup, right? Yeah. Like, but I mean, that's the part people don't think about. You go buy like you go on normalguysupercar.com. You go buy a Klein exhaust, okay. Let's say the exhaust costs you five grand. 
That's cheap okay. for plane exhaust. <laughs> Just cheap. So we lose 3% right off the bat because of the credit card. So we lost 3%. Now I got to pay another 40, 50 bucks for the wire fee. And then like chances are we didn't charge you enough for shipping. And depending what state you live in, we may have like to eat some taxes and all. There's anyway, $300 like, gone. Three, four hundred yeah. dollars gone. In it just it adds up. It adds yeah. up a lot. Yep. So yeah. All right. It's it's already 9 30. We should yeah, probably wrap late. it up. Jeez. It's time for the post the That's post right. live. The party. It's time okay. for the real, party. The real show. I kind of wanna I one of these days, okay, maybe it's next week. I want to do something for all the members of the channel that watch this where we have the members join us on a post live. That'd be fun. I don't know if I don't know how to set that all up. I need to set it all up, but it'd be cool because, like, the post live is actually quite entertaining. Yes. So, are you anyway, are you going to make a private live? I think I would have to make live? a second a second yeah, live second stream, live. Yep. and then we'd have to all switch over to that. Right. Yeah. So maybe we'll try that next time. But you should make that second private one visible to other people who aren't oh, Just to be a dick. Oh, like, yeah. <laughs> you are not uh, uh, access denied. Access denied. <laughs> right, right. Yeah. Rude. Yeah. I was just thinking of something special to like, because, you know, hey, if you're if you're actually like giving us money on a monthly basis, that's, you know, mm -hmm. we should, you should get something for it. Well, they're, they're, well they could do stuff, like, a... but, like do more. I want to do more. You can make it a public video and then delist it right away so it doesn't stay up. Like the other thing we can do live. is we can make it so that only members can comment. Oh, oh that'd be cool. That that could be what we could do is like, hey, it's just all only members can comment. Yeah, and then if they want, they can join in. That'd be fun. Yeah. yeah that'd be, I'd be that'd down be for that. Cool. I'll tell you what. We'll do a we'll do an experiment. We got an experiment. Any of you who are members of the channel. Send me an email, dan at normalguysupercar.com, and I'll send you a link to the live stream, and you can join us in the post live. Oh, right now. Oh, shit. Dude, you're going to have to verify everything. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, no, they'll have to, like, actually. It's up to 10, right? So there's four more that four more slots? Yeah, I can do I can do uh, 10, I think, 10, yeah. 10 okay. slots. Well, that means there's only four members that are going to be able to join. Yeah. A, whatever. Like, I, I would assume there's not that many people who are actually going to join tonight. <laughs> Oh, I bet you you're going to get inundated with requests. Uh, Quick sign up. Somebody suggested that people contribute get NGS 20. You uh, Depending on what that 20% no, we can't do 20 that because, of a client exhaust so, right, is a lot so, of money. No, but also some of the people that, uh, like some of the products, we can't even give you 20%. We'd lose money. Yeah. Like like a lot. Oh, John Poole. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, I'll send you. He's one. on it. All right. <laughs> All right, hold on. Where's the damn? That's what we're email? talking about, Tom. Yeah. We're talking about. Where's the, the live people? email? I sent it to him. I sent it to oh, him. Oh, you did? He's, All right. Yeah, he's got it. You better oh. quick end it. He found it fast. Huh? <laughs> Cut him off again. Yeah. <laughs> Poor Pietro. That's why he's not here tonight. He's still sad about last week. <laughs> that was hilarious. So. <laughs> What about you, loyal subscribers? I appreciate all of you, loyal subscribers. No, seriously, I do. Yeah, I'm just saying, like, hey, if you're literally giving us money, that's some people are paying down more, more and Adam more per month than mm -hmm. they do for cable. Shockingly, <laughs> that's, so it's I mean, only Fred. Well, yeah, perhaps, but Fred, Fred is, but which is not even here. So paying ten and twenty dollars a month is like it's mm. substantial for a modestly sized like when, when all that stuff actually came available i'm like no one's gonna do this and i was like oh my god people are actually doing this okay that's very nice of you oh 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 all right here's one person i'm gonna send it to him right now it's all on the YouTube jonathan page, if jonathan. you yeah you go on to the profile page and there's three different well, tiers oh look at that for a dollar Boop. a month judge is here yeah. <laughs> hold on judge uh you're still alive though we're gonna have to shut off the live yeah. Yeah. <laughs> hi judge <laughs> you're on youtube there's tens of people watching here <laughs> there's oh uh, man there's 91 people I bet you feel hey, that's pretty good for an hour and a half in oh oh yeah look at here's more people more oh, people shit. members right. the members are like i want members are doing it all right well anyway i'm gonna shut it down because i don't want to like you know anyway it, we yeah. appreciate cool. seriously i appreciate everyone whether or not you're a member i'm just saying like hey you know Added bonus. We so. apologize for being our authentic selves, but we figured that's what differentiates us. Right. 
So anyway, we'll see you guys next week. We appreciate it. Thank you so much. Adios. Good night.